everyone and welcome to another week of Trailer Thursdays. The first trailer I'm going to talk to you guys about today is for a movie called Hyde Park on Hudson and it stars Bill Murray and Laura Linney and they play these cousins who are having an affair with each other while um, Bill Murray is playing the president, FDR, and it's just this crazy whirlwind of things that are just bound to happen. It's something different, like I feel like I've never seen a movie with him playing such a serious role. He's normally like the funny guy, you know, being in Ghostbusters or Groundhog Day. But he actually has had some pretty good movies out, um, like Lost in Translation, for example. So I definitely know that a role like this could um, fit him. Um, properly. Of course, there have been so many movies about the presidents coming out recently, and I think that this looks good, so I'm definitely interested in seeing this movie. I don't know if I'm going to see it in the movie theater or just like a rental or something, but it's definitely one not to miss out on because I think the story looks interesting. I mean, he's already supposed to be married and he's having this affair with his cousin. I mean, who knows what's going to happen. I mean, it's family. So, I don't know how legal that is. I think it looks pretty awesome. So, let me know in the comments what you guys think of um, Hyde Park on Hudson. You guys can check out the trailer in the description. And moving on to the second trailer of the day is for Les Miserables. It stars Hugh Jackman, Anne Hathaway, Russell Crowe, Amanda Seyfried. It's just this huge star-studded cast in this musical turned movie. And I think it looks really impressive. It comes out this December. When I saw this trailer and I knew that there was going to be some pretty interesting characters in this movie, especially one that I really am looking forward to see and that is Anne Hathaway because I'm a huge fan of hers first of all and she sings in the trailer and I know like she just has an amazing voice and of course the one other thing um, that I was interested in was when she literally chopped off all her hair for this role and that shows true dedication. I love that in actors when they're really putting forth an effort to make their roles well known and hopefully noticeable by the audience. So this one is definitely something I think everybody should see and of course um, I'm really digging these sideburns from Hugh Jackman's character as well as the whole like Napoleon-esque looking figure of Russell Crowe and I don't know why Amanda Seyfried's in this but I think she is a all like another good actress so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing this movie uh, just because of just the sheer awesomeness and how like many like well-known actors are in this movie and I really like that aspect of movies as well also, this movie is directed by Tom Hooper, who won for The King's Speech, so I also like that movie, and I think he's done some pretty impressive movies in the past, so this one definitely recommend seeing, and I can't wait to see it, so you guys should definitely check out the trailer, let me know in the comments about this movie if you're interested in seeing it. The third and final trailer of the day is a movie that I had been somewhat interested in. I actually haven't read the book, but it is for The Great Gatsby, and it stars Leonardo DiCaprio, Carrie Mulligan, um, Tobey Maguire, Joel Edgerton, and I think this movie looks really cool. It's directed by Boz Lerman, who you probably know um, directed Moulin Rouge, as well as Romeo and Juliet, that also starred Leonardo DiCaprio. And I think this movie just looks amazing, just the visuals. And I was kind of laughing in the trailer when um, sort of like the auto-tune came on and sort of like the same music from a Safe House trailer. I was like, this is crazy. But I think it added like a little new twist to the whole like feel of the movie and it's set in the 20s and of course everybody's got their like nice like fancy outfits on. They all look pretty good. So... If I see some like definite Moulin Rouge-esque things going on in this movie, I think it's going to look pretty wild. I think the character is going to be really amazing, and I hope that this movie will also define Leonardo DiCaprio as an actor. I know he's been snubbed by Oscars, and just like some of his roles he's done in the past have been overlooked, and I think this one will also define him as an actor, so definitely watching out for the buzz on this movie. 
if you want, you can let me know in the comments what you guys thought of any one of these trailers, you guys, if you check them out. And if you're looking forward to any one of these movies, oh, and also Great Gatsby comes out in December as well as Les Mis, you guys can subscribe to my channel. I've got more movie reviews, movie updates, and come back every week for another Trailer Thursday video. You guys can also like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, and I will see you guys later.